this year's Thanksgiving, of course, looks a little different. With restric restrictions in place, people across Central Oregon are having to adjust. Alec Nolan caught up with some folks around Bend to find out how they're celebrating. 2020 has certainly been one of the more interesting years in recent memory. But on this holiday, people have to be thankful for something, right? Well, I went around Bend today to find out. It's the age-old question that pops up every year. What are you thankful for? Each other. Oh my gosh, I'm thankful for so uh, much. everything that comes my way in this world. Uh, I feel blessed. Best friends Isla and Jane are thankful for each other. They had to cancel their travel plans to be with family, but they're still finding a way to celebrate. We are going to go get bags of chicken from Safeway and go stop by all of our friends and just say hi. And they don't sure have to feed us because yeah. we're going to have our own bags of chicken yeah, they, available. We're just going to provide ourselves. With indoor dining unavailable, many are turning to restaurants like downtown's Pine Tavern for some turkey takeout. We have quite a few uh, takeout orders planned for today, so uh, there'll be hot turkey and, and hot prime rib flying out of the Pine Tavern today. General Manager Anthony Abrams says quarantine and isolation have been tough, but he's still finding ways to be thankful. Even though we've been uh, kind of isolating and, and, and uh, separated, uh, it makes me a lot more thankful for my family, uh, our staff, the people here in the city. Others, like Datar Sahi and his dog, are spending their first Thanksgiving here in Bend. It just happens to also be in the middle of a pandemic. Well, I'm from California most recently. Don't tell anybody in Bend. And my brother and uh, his fiance are coming from Newport, Oregon. We're going to hang out and just have a nice in-home dinner. Sahi says you combine the virus, wildfires, and all these restrictions, and it certainly hasn't been easy. But he's trying to take the situation in stride. I guess what I'm most thankful for is an opportunity to be alone and to fight through that desire to want to be more connected to other people. I think that it's, uh, it's going to leave a permanent social mark on us as individuals and a society for a time to come. The holiday is different this year, but it's clear that there is still a lot to be thankful for. In Bend, Alec Nolan, News Channel 21.